welcome to Epan and uh, I'm going to show today the Epan co I've uh, been talking to Barry, Barry's recently uh, spoken to a customer with one or two issues, so Barry, do you want to just give me a quick reminder as to what the issue yeah, was? Yeah, so what they were saying was they get um, you know, a lot of the projects that they do, um, and I think this is quite typical that a lot of engineers, whether it's the customer or the sales guy comes along at the 11th hour yeah. uh, and wants to make some kind of change in the cost implication and the time implication for that is phenomenal. Yeah. Um, and obviously you were mentioning that yeah. you know, it's quite easy to do, isn't it? Definitely, so what I'll do, I'll show you here. We go with a standard project. So we can go with a project, one click of a button, but as we all know, customers want different uh, options and variants of the standard machines anyway. So we go into this little configuration area here. So do we want a measuring transducer, like a phase monitor? Do we want standard control, which we'll go with there? Uh, we hit the generate. And what that's now doing is collecting all the standard drawings from a standard library. So no more copying from different projects around uh, your, uh, the systems. So that's really powerful for the creation if you're doing original, similar projects, every ever time, so slightly different, yeah? Everyone's working from the same new sheet, so what we can do, we can go into here, we can go to the page, we can go into this section just here. So there's our power supply section with a phase monitor. Like you mentioned, if the client specification changes, we can turn, it doesn't want that. So maybe he's going with a cheaper option, so it's going to cost too much to have that in there. We hit the generate one more time. That's now rebuilding the project again from the standard libraries on here. So we're just waiting for a green light to come to the top on here. We give that a second or two. So there, here's a green light. So now we go back into our power supply page. As you can see, we now turn off the phase monitor. The other one we mentioned was reversing contactor. So on here, we can see we've now got the, uh, the contactor and a quick change on that one. We can now do a variable speed drive, reconfigure onto here. That's going through, going to rebuild it on there one more time. So that's when you say rebuilding, that's going through every part of that, every every that part project, of that project, linking it all back in again. Back in on that. So a quick and easy change, back into here now look, that we've now got a variable speed drive coming through rather than the regular uh, control. So, so that's rule driven, rule driven to speed up the process of speed those changes. Yeah, more automation, more schematics, more speed.